Hello dear traders, I'm Mena Kaswatkina back with you with another financial release for today on Insta TV. Some traders are keeping the bullish stance on oil. Their hopes have not been in vain. Eventually, they see long-awaited contraction in the U.S. come true. The data on the U.S. crude inventories for the recent two weeks indicates this change. The report released yesterday again did not meet the expectations. In fact, the oil inventories added 1.3 million barrels instead of projected growth by 4 million barrels. As a result, yesterday Texas Light Sweet completed the session at the peak since early of 2015. Texas Light Sweet coped with the important resistance level at 54 US dollars 15 cents a barrel after holding below this level for a long time. From my viewpoint, surpassing this level, WTI is likely to make corrections today or tomorrow in the context of being overbought. Then, WTI is expected to keep on growing to 59 US dollars a barrel unless the overall background on the crude market exerts если, конечно, внешний фон на рынке сырой нефти не придавит ее. Growth of crude prices is encouraged by Saudi Arabia dropping hints that the kingdom was ready to reduce its oil output with the aim of preventing a further slump in prices. Moreover, Brent crude, the European benchmark grade, also hit a fresh high since early this year. Today, Brent crude from the North Sea is correcting its price. However, it is still holding at a high level and trading at almost 62 US dollars a barrel. Nevertheless, according to the estimates of the International Energy Agency, the global oil market needs a lot of time to strike a balance between supply and demand. Meanwhile, the global oil output still exceeds consumption. This imbalance could worsen after Iran starts its supplies to the crude market. This was Daily Financial News on Insta TV. Stay tuned. Bye.